Hi there, Inventory Planners. This is the second of a two-part series on trying to figure out which forecasting is right for you. So today we're gonna to talk about top-down versus bottom-up forecasting. Bottom-up forecasting is what we traditionally think of when we're looking at customer demand and forecasting what the demand is going to be. That means that we're looking at each variant or the bottom level, the most granular level of our information and figuring out what the trends are there so that we can forecast demand. Top-down forecasting is looking at a higher level of data. So we're looking at categories, brands, vendor, even store-wide. What are our trends so that we can forecast demand? Now, when you're trying to think through which one to use when, I would say that bottom-up forecasting is good for the majority of forecasting. That's what we usually use. But top-down forecasting can be really helpful one, if you have seasonal products, two, that don't have a long sales history. So when we're looking at sales history for seasonal products, we're typically looking at what happened 12 months ago. But say that product's only been around for three months, how do we figure out what the seasonal trends are? Well, we can look at the seasonal trend of the category and apply that trending to the variant level. So that's when top-down forecasting can be really useful.